Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing. Uh, you got so many idle animations. Right. I was going to play some uh, fun times aid getting, but a mini game popped out, and I feel like I need to do it. Uh, I don't want to, but I guess I'll do it. Like, I mean, I I don't have to, you know, Alcal. If you don't feel like it, but it's pro look. I'd rather do it now than later. So here we go, Galaxy Monkey. Third mini game after getting so many Spectre coins. How to? And let's look at the options. So vibrate stereo store. All right. How to? Lipstick move. Oh, oh! It's a uh, one of those Galaxy Fight things. I don't know if that's the term, but you know, like asteroids. Uh... Oh, I see. You gotta press. Yeah. That's it. That's it. I mean, that's it. Whoa. And then we get all of these. You get a face you can blow up, as well as a sphere. That's a face graphic. The space pig is fun, though. All right, so there's normal and there's time attack. Okay, um, I'm player one. All right, we're just riding. Ready? Yeah, so I hear I exist. We got enemies. Get a power up. Get a double blast. Already level two. Okay, the wall turns all like, like that to say, hey, be careful. All right, my shots are very loud. Don't worry about them. Space Pig gets big before he blows up. Everyone knows that. Everyone knows that about Space Pig. Pig from space. All right, here we go. These, yeah, watch out. Oh, triple shot. Here we go. This feels like the kind of game where, you know, you get some power-ups, you get pretty strong, and then you die, you lose your power-up, and suddenly you can't really, like, keep up anymore. Alright, looks like it stops at three layers of power-up. Okay, fair enough. Uh, I'm just here in my little spaceship, uh, destroying the world. Uh, but you get points, though, when you get it, when you don't need it. Talking about a pee! Destroy the world and everything inside if you want. Uh, there's Big Face. That's Big Face, alright. Alright, Pig, you are pretty fast, honestly. Like, you know, you're a little worrisome. A little bit. But not worrisome enough for me to actually worry. You know, I just say I'm worried. Without actually being it. Oh. Well, that's Space Orb, but it's very hardy. Lots of health on a big space orb, uh, as one would expect. But this is interesting, because this does seem designed. Like, it looks like it's particular enemies from particular direction with every level. So I wonder if there is a limit. Like, can you beat this? I mean, levels go in the three digits. I mean, also, it could just be picking from, like, a selection. And actually, it is infinite. And it's just like the higher you go, the more stuff it adds to the collection. Okay, so you might not necessarily destroy the space orb. That's why it's so many points. You kind of want to get real close to hit with as many bullets as possible. Big face, though! Big face in space! Uh, space out your face into the universe. That's, that's a weird statement. I don't know what to make of that statement. Check it out. There's a monkey. Now the monk is inside of you. UFO. Though. Yeah, see, this is new and different, and I miss with most of my projectiles. I don't know what are the rules of Space Orb. I haven't got a high score yet, but I am getting there. I mean, I haven't even died once, so, you know. Don't mention that out loud if you... Whoa, we split into two. One face became two. That's what I call breakfast. Okay, destroy the universe if you can afford to. Oh shoot, that was clumsy on me. And yeah, now I'm power down. I am the sad little ape saucer with just like just a fragment of my damage potential that I had before. I mean, you know, there's only two layers though, the three layers. Uh, so like it's fine. You're not too distraught if you lose your stuff, but I, I mean, I can feel a difference, but there you go, see? We're already back, and I made a really bad call in terms of direction to go there. I, I made a bad decision. Hey, I got into the high score table. I'm happy, because I don't think this is gonna end. Uh, oh, 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 oh. There you go, oh, yeah, he's kind of stopped shooting there for a hot second. That happens, uh, happens to the best of us. Alright, so destroy the world and... Oh, shoot. 
then I got clumsy. I just, I just made a bad decision. I have a weird tendency to really kind of like go down low like that, and um... Not the best of calls, you know? Not the best of strat. You know what? That's, that was really good. I mean, it's a twin stick shooter. It's hard to mess it up, but it is possible to mess it up. And they made a really good one. Like, that was genuinely pretty good. But I also only played for, like, five minutes. So we will be hunting down monkeys. And, I mean, though, like, so here's the thing. We did an entirety of World 1. That was really quick. But then the first stage I had to do in World 2, like, this, this thick jungle here, like, it, it did take a session. So there's a possibility that this is the only level I fully clear. It's that's not a problem per se though, but let's see. Yeah, there's seven monkeys to get and three coins. This is like an end game level. <laughs> but that's fine. You know what? There's a monkey up there, by the way. Oh, this is the place where I immediately went into like the the four expert area. And then uh I thrived there, if you don't mind me absolutely lying. Wow. Yeah, I remember. So wait, is there a thing on top there then? Can I even go on top there? Probably, right? What? Yeah, you were in the paint. Oh, wait, why didn't you climb? Grab! Grab! Okay, there you now you grabbed. You are just running against the wall. You don't know what's happening at all! Alright, so the music is getting a bit weird, but that is fine. Gonna do some platforming all over the place, all over time. Yeah, we're supposed to be in the, like, the super past right now. Like, not the absolute past, but, you know, the super... You're not a monkey. I'm not interested in you, sorry, I know. Rude? Yeah, absolutely. I'm not gonna defend myself. Alright, so there's that cage area that I couldn't go into last time. But this time I will destroy the wall. No? Okay. Dest oh, wait a second. That's just a button. Did I? Like, isn't it? No. Okay, look for... Wait, can I just go over the cage? Yes, I can. Alright, well, that solved... Oh, so the red stuff is just like a UFO that crashed here. Alright. Solved this mystery. There really wasn't one. But I saw- Oh, but you got a basement door. You got like a brand new area here. Alright, what do you want? Do you know you can use D-pad to move the camera around? Imagine playing up to here without knowing that. Alright, flamey guy. You blew up. Ridiculous. Flamey guy, you're running away. Stop it. Alright, alright, good. You probably shouldn't have just taken this thing immediately. So that was a very weird sound effect that was happening in my house, in my apartment. Alright, so we got... What the hell is that noise? Mm, they see you, the wind's so strong, it'll blow you away! Yeah, okay, so they're making... Fascinating to me that they're teaching this here in a spot that, like, you need to have advanced tools to get. Alright, well, look, it's fine. Oh, you got, you got explosives, though. That's less fine. You're the explosive type of monkey? You sure are. And now I can't run after you. I'm probably gonna die here, honestly. Okay, uh, this could be a problem. Wow, that is a strong fan. Uh, whoa, shoot! Whoa. Thanks, Pit. You're the best. I'm glad you're here. I, I, I was wondering out loud to myself if it would be simpler to, like, go at him from above? Uh, I wonder. He's got this very, very scary thing to go through. Alright, I'm being fired at. That's fine. It happens. Yeah, I don't think I can get to him from here. Unless I can, like, knock him out with an explosion? See, now he's on the floor after being blown up, and then I can just get him. There you go. That's just called being smart. Sometimes being smart is good. It happens. 
Okay, uh, oh, there's clearly a thing up there using that weird, like, super awkward looking little, like, side thing, right? You can be on this. Do you want to be on this? Good question. I know there's a door further in the back, but, you know, let's do things one step at a time. Ah, monkey here. Here you go. So it's another case where there's just, like, basically this side place to the world. Like, here, welcome to, like, side action. Whew. Almost fall in a pit, maybe. I don't know. Every time I fall, I feel like there's a pit somewhere. There you go. Punched. Now I get to eat flavorless cookies that are good for my health. Oh boy. So here's the door. Maybe this is... You know how I never went into the main ruins of this uh, level? What if this is like... The cage part is like the exit. The intended exit. No, because it just kind of leaves here and then... You're here and you're alone, and there's nothing else going on. This is, in fact, its own thing. Alright, monkey radar. Oh, okay, there's something in the next room still. Here. There is still a friend. Uh, hard to pinpoint, though. Okay, so I'm thinking that... You know, like here, you, oh yeah, see it continues here too. And this will lead to something possibly. Where? Let's just do that for fun? I don't know, is it pointing at the door? Like, is it pointing at the door? Oh, it's really hard to tell. I mean, it's not, but... But there's nothing in that room. Oh, I don't know. It's saying there's one really close. Is there something here? I mean, there's nothing here. Like, it's- maybe this is a room in another room, and that's why this is- Yeah, he's detecting a guy that's outside. Because this is probably technically the outside map. Okay. There's some nuances to this. Alright, back outside. There's nothing- can I climb this? I can climb this. This little pole here that exists. That's fun, and you know, there's another pull right here, you know, pretty mysterious, can climb that too, okay, okay, how confident am I on my ability to get up there, not in the slightest, but it happened anyway, what is my, um, one more to get somewhere, got it, uh, this is a scary spot to be at, so let's just fall off. <laughs> Let's just fall off. Simpler that way. So yeah, see, this existed strictly for the return, because you needed resources you wouldn't have otherwise. Uh, okay, I feel like now I want to go on this roof. You know, that sounds like something I want to do. Yeah, over there is the expert's only route, which I've already been. I mean, was there a thing I needed a thing to get over there? I literally do not remember. Pretty sure there's a monkey on top here, though. But maybe there's a door that leads back? I can hear a monkey, clearly. Ape. If I do this... Yeah, no, see, there's like a sort of roof during the whole thing. Also, there's a down? How do you get down? Uh, 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 uh. Okay, not really happening. So, this is too high. Yeah. Alright, maybe there's a... This leads to a door on top of it, is my thought. Like, it's what would make an, an awful lot of sense. I remember getting killed by this slime cat. Slime cat, most powerful force in the universe. When it feels like it. Ooh, this looks pretty good, even if it looks pretty wrong. Right, no, there's slime, slime cat theater here. There's a middle, there's a that. I'm kind of interested to see where this leads. 
Well, there's the last Spectre coin. Maybe I can cheese a little bit and not have to go down the fun slide. Yeah, so all coins gone. That's taken care of. Ooh, do you think you can just hula hoop up there, though? Like, is that what was the intent? Find out! No. Absolutely not. You fool. You idiot. Alright, good. Uh, oh, there's a thing. I can blow up if I so desire, and I do. Hey, monkey. You're the monkey doing sounds. Oh, oh and you're the one powering the, the bridge falling. I am terrible at this monkey connection business. Whoa, hi there, statue face. You can't be destroyed? Ah, oh, well, learn something new every day. So what am I seeing here? Like, is that a thing, or...? Uh, I mean, there are platforms and stuff down there. Okay, it's probably not gonna be my first place to explore, though. I don't know. Hi, statue, you're doing your best! Uh, I don't have a choice here. I Okay, these are a lot easier to destroy with a fist. Oh, elevator? Alright, so this is the fun drop that I skip. So this platform down here is the elevator equivalent, probably. So I should check it out and I can see your shirt. Yeah! There we go. I lost one, so that will give it back to me. Anything else here? Just another slide. Alright, I mean, I looked, and I did get a reward. Not the reward I wanted, but a reward, and a useful reward of that. Alright, I can go through here. Look at that. That's so neat that there's like a in-universe explanation for it. So there's that's a pet. You can fall through these vines, and I don't want to. I want to go over here and end up on top. Stop, says the hand. Hand stop. All right, you are running very slow, so of course I'm still gonna struggle to get you. Here you go, do a little spin. We're on top of the universe, or at the very least this temple place. It's pretty good. What's with the stop though? I don't know. Can I go further up? I mean, I want to go further up. Can I like hit that? I think you're supposed to push this. Pushing is a mechanism in this game, right? That you do like, two times. Oh, and that's back here! Completing the loop. So this is the starting point of that yard zone. Okay. And as a bonus, by falling off, if I want to return back there, I have to go like all the way back. Uh, well, let's... Okay, so that to me is telling me inside. Inside. I mean, I did things here. Is there... More here? Yeah, like it's very close. Oh, did I? Oh, there's a little guy up there. How did I miss you? Well, I guess I wasn't looking at the right spot. All right, that happens. I did not mean to blow you up, buddy. That was a bit of overkill. I'll be the first yes. to admit it. <laughs> it's fine. Blowing up apes is what apes are for. Wow, that sounds mean. Don't do that. But here we go, it's done. Honkies all captured. And I'm pretty sure I have all coins too. And yeah, like I'm just... I just recorded just long enough. I don't want to go into... If I had not played Galaxy Monkey, I probably would have seen this next level. But because I did, though, this is gonna be a one-level cleanup. And you know what? That's okay. Because, yeah, like, we end up just going all over the place. And that's normal. And that's fine. Because, yeah, like, so, like, Dark Rune, next place... Oh, Cryptic Relics only has three to get. Okay, you know what? No. Let's go and get... No, uh, you know what? No. Uh, return. It's the weirdest buttons. I only have three monkeys to find and cryptic relics. Let's do that. I changed my mind. Yeah, like the size of levels can vary a lot. It is surprising. But I mean, I think it's good that they offer themselves a lot of um, leeway. 
So three monkeys, how many coins? And one coin, and I never found. Okay. Sounds good! What level is this? Okay, I remember the wall I had to blow up once. Let's yeah, go. this one. Did I ever go in here? Like, is this a thing, or is it just part of the... No, like, it's not a separate area. Uh oh you're dead. Yeah, the push block. That thing that is used constantly forever. My favorite... Something. Alright, but we got this we can destroy. Alright, and that's a big shortcut that leads us here. Get out of here. Whoa, can I just pop uh, one of these while it's active? That is stupidly strong. So not in there, but definitely in there. Nowhere else. Suits me. Here we go. Did I even go there before the first time I played? I don't know. I think I remember this. Get out of here. So the, ac the action's over there, but I mean, punch it. This is probably just a shortcut then, and I just pop. Uh, I tried to jump, and the game was like, I don't know. Can you repeat that later? So I am unable to open. Okay, okay, you gotta use that process. Well, let's follow. Our jaunty little. Wait a sec. I had a. I can go up here, which I wouldn't have been able to do before. Can I punch this orb? Punch orb! Oh, well, there's a coin I needed. I did it! I found it! L2. So it's right there, spineless and ruthless, doing some graffitis. Alright, are you in here? Can I get in here? I don't know. But maybe I can do something through this waterway, though, huh? Yeah, that's right. Waterway maze. Like, I know I gotta go in roughly this direction, and it doesn't look like I've been here. Uh-huh. Yeah, this feels like very early game hint, so I don't know about that. Alright, radar. Yeah, you're like on the other side of the swamp. Okay, I don't know where I am then, but I'm here. Uh, have I ever been here? I mean, there's a button I can press. I'll press that. Oh, this is like a shadow wall of some kind. That's just strange. All right, so I opened up that gate. Gate has been opened with the press of a button, leading us to a brand new nightmare. Please don't fall off. Have I ever been here? A valid question. I mean, the radar kind of pointed in roughly this direction. Okay, I feel like I kind of have to slingshot that guy, so I'm gonna do that. Bop. There we go, he fell. What a fool. Like, I... Oh, jeez. Okay, this is safer than it looks like, it turns out. It's... That's surprising. Yeah. There's a little weird ice plant thing while you throw fireballs. There's a shirt in the backyard. That's yeah. not all. I hope it's not all. Yeah, now we're here. I can hear the monkey. The monkey's right there. He's the one doing graffitis. I missed him entirely. There we go. Fireproof when under duress. There you go. Get out of here. And gate, get out of here. Everything. That is the hard work of this monkey. That's what it looks like. All right, okay, monkey radar. I'm so glad you're there. I'm so glad you're a thing. Okay, somewhere over there. Vaguely over there. I mean, there's monkey frescoes all over the wall. That's pretty good. So we're gonna go inside here. Inside here, looks like it. Okay, actually, yeah, we're getting re- I don't know if I've been- I feel like I've been here. Oh, is he on top of this? Oh, I'm destroying this! Okay, alright, well, I can keep destroying this column. <laughs> it looks really goofy, though, but yeah, absolutely. There we go, monkey got him! Okay, another one pretty close. Like, over there? Oh, I cannot go on that windowsill, actually. 
Uh, is there a way through here? This looks suspiciously like, like a plug. Like, yeah, radar, very strong symbol. Right over there. So how do I get there? Oh, no, wait, you can go up here. I just saw that. Okay, it's not a thing to cut, it's a thing to go through. It's a thing to go up. And then you get bullied by a watermelon. Don't worry about it. It is the kind of thing that happens. But you shouldn't worry, though. Man, I... Okay, I wasn't looking into where you were. That's fair. Welcome to the cage. Okay, you gotta use a car. Because you could get all the way here without car. That's true. Well, it's car time. Nope. Did I not put car on? Well, now I did. It's car time! Hey, monkey! It's car time! <laughs> Let's upset you. Alright, yeah, no, yeah. Oh, check it out. And then, but then you also see me, and I'm also upsetting? I don't know what's most upsetting. Me or the monkey or the car? Well, it's the monkey. But to the monkey, who's more upsetting? I don't know. Well, look at that! See, in this stage, it went by pretty quickly. Again, just the sniffer. The invention of the sniffer in collectathon games like that, collectathons, is you just is just so good. It's just so useful. It is so practical. It is such a game changer, and it enables a lot of flexibility. Because at the same time, it lets devs like they can go a little bit tricky because the tool exists to be able to to undo. It's like you got you know, and it doesn't like spell things out completely. It's just very smart in general. All right, and so we got Kyle, Fun Sun, Shiny Gun. Got Stan. Some of these we've already seen. I don't know which one. Kenny guarding the entrance. That I know you're new. Crap, man. Too afraid to look down. There's Nuzzy. I remember getting him my first time. Papu from Oh Solitude. I remember that split dude. I'm not sure how. Really big mouth on that trance. Burnt. Way has too much fun to care. Yeah, he's just having fun on, on the stuff. Uh, yeah, that was one of the guys I struggled with the first time. The other guy first, and this guy too. TV goggles. Uh, in here. Well, Oceana. We're gonna do that next time. Uh, poor little guy. You just change, please. There's a Koopa. That's what it looks like here, being pushy. Shot a hole in his foot. I feel like I remember that. Looks angry, acts mean. The soul of a poet on his little column that I destroyed. Uh, King of the Apes right there. It was just one of them, it turns out. That's pretty shocking. And yeah, Oceana it keeps showing it because I've been there before, right? It's return. It's, it's the start button to go away from the screen. That is just so weird. Button decisions in this game. Fantastic decisions. All right, and uh, we are going today from 60 to 64. You know, it, it goes forward. It still shows Spectreland as the as the last icon though, because it is the last level. I guess now they're just always forever gonna be Spectreland, which is a little unfortunate. Uh, you know, I like the variety of pictures that would happen, but there's a finiteness to how much you can make that happen. <laughs> 